After the post of uh, my menu and pop-up menu, I have been asked to, to show how the uh, new Cooks 2 controls work, um, especially the my menu and pop-up menu. So let's uh, let's start creating a new form, and now I'm going to place here uh, my menu. These controls uh, works very much uh, the same like in the previous uh, version, but the main thing is that they are using the latest uh, version of Cooks do, and it's uh, easier for us, a lot easier for us, to keep this updated. So, as you can see, we are getting the same results. The main menu is a bit uh, fancier, it looks uh, better. And now let's use an image list. I'm going to add several ones. PNG. Okay. Now I'm going to edit the items property and select this is the image one and this is the image two and then I'm going to assign which image list I'm going to show. So this menu looks uh, a bit better. Also you can handle the click of a button of an item, sorry. So when an item is clicked, we are getting the tag for that item. So in this case, I have forgot to set a different tag for each item. Tag two. Okay. And if we want to process the onclick uh, event on JavaScript, we do exactly the same. So, as you can see, you are getting which item in JavaScript without performing any post. Also, the pop-up menu, for the the new Cooks do pop-up menu, can have images, and also the items can be exactly the the same. You can copy and paste, but for this uh, pop-up menu to be shown, you have to use the new Cooks2 controls. Uh, in this case, this cannot be attached to the uh, previous, uh, to the standard or the, or the basic ones. So, you can attach it using the pop-up menu property and then run. And when you right click, you are getting exactly the same. You can generate here and now you run and you are getting the expected result. And for JavaScript, is exactly the same. Okay. So it works very much the same, but with the new Cooks2 library. Okay. So 
this is it don't forget to read the post because there are instructions there how you can get this functionality because the, this is in, in an update of the RPCL library and feel free to ask any question you have thank you